Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use your nail buffer as a nail stamper so you can get the perfect French manicure at home without the hassle of using your nail polish brush to paint on each French tub. This hack works just as great as the viral TikTok French manicure stamper that looks like this. I'm sure you guys have seen it everywhere by now. And if you don't have one of these, then that's okay because any nail buffer can act as a nail stamper and you'll get similar results so I highly recommend trying this out and let's get straight into the video. After prepping your nails and filing them, the first thing that you want to do is take your white nail polish and apply a generous coat onto the bottom end of the square side of your nail buffer. The trick is to slowly stamp on the French tip to each nail. This works really well if your nails are long. Mine were pretty short for this video so the nail polish did get onto my finger but if you want more of a cleaner application then definitely try this out when your nails are longer. I'm able to get a really nice smile line just by pushing the nail into the buffer and slowly removing it so that each nail is coated with the nail polish. I always like to apply more white nail polish onto the buffing block before stamping the tip of each nail. That way the French tip comes out evenly. Once that's done, I like to take a Q-tip and dip it into some acetone to remove any mistakes around the edges of the nail. And you can also use a thin paintbrush if you want more precision. I'm just gonna go ahead and make sure everything looks nice and clean before going in and applying my clear coat. Now since I'm using acetone, it's definitely going to dry out my cuticles and as you guys can see, they're looking a bit dry so I highly recommend using a good cuticle oil or you can use coconut oil that works just as well. I usually like to apply it overnight so that it gets fully absorbed into my skin. The cuticle oil is going to help hydrate your nails so that your manicure looks flawless and it'll also strengthen your nails which is very important and my favorite part is that it's going to add a lot of shine to the nails so definitely make sure you do this step after your manicure has fully dried. Now I'm going in and applying my clear coat. It literally took me only a few minutes to stamp on my French tips and this hack just saves me so much time and I'm able to get the perfect French manicure on both hands without having to worry about one side looking uneven or having to struggle painting my nails using my left hand. I'm able to just stamp on my tips without any hassle and I'm good to go. And these are the final results. I absolutely love how my nails turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.